यफा था बी ओपन आई लाइक टू इन्वाइट यू अटेंशन टू द बाइबल द गॉस्पल अकॉर्डिंग टू सेंट मार्क चैप्टर सेवन वर्स इज थर्टी वन टू थर्टी सेवन हियर वी कैन सी एन इंसिडेंट वेन जीसस हील्स अ डेफ एंड म्यूट मैन अ डेफ एंड डम मैन वॉज हील्ड इंस्टेंटली बाई जीसस लेट्स रीड दिस वर्स नंबर थर्टी वन ऑफ मार्क चैप्टर सेवन वर्स थर्टी वन and again departing from the region of Tyre and Sidon he came through the midst of the region of Decapolis to the sea of Galilee so Jesus was traveling so he departed from the region of Tyre and Sidon then he came through the midst of the region of Decapolis to the sea of Galilee then what happened then they brought to him one who was deaf and had an impediment in his speech and they begged him to put his hand on him so then wherever jesus went there were multitude there were people following him because they knew that he could do signs wonders and miracles they knew they were already heard about the the miracles that jesus had performed so they brought to him a man a man who was deaf and mute he couldn't hear, hear and he couldn't speak he had that impediment or oh, imagine the situation of that person a person who couldn't speak a person who couldn't hear oh if somebody calls his name he wouldn't be able to hear it if uh, he had to say something he couldn't say it oh what kind of a tragedy or what kind of a disastrous life this person was leading all because of one thing he couldn't hear and he couldn't speak my dear friend there are so many people in this world who are still unable to hear or speak oh what a tragedy oh what kind of problems they are going through on a day to day basis that on uh, similarly in those times there was such a person and people brought him to jesus they had faith that jesus could heal him they wanted him uh, they wanted jesus to lay his hands on him then what happened yes Uh, then they brought to him one who was deaf and had an impediment in his speech and they begged him to put his hand on him and he took him aside from the multitude so jesus what did he do he took him aside from the multitude and put his fingers in his ears and he spat and touched his tongue so jesus he took this man aside then he spat on his um then he spat and touched his tongue then he then he put his fingers in his ears so jesus put his fingers in the ears of this deaf man then he spat and he touched his tongue then looking up to heaven he sighed and said ya fatha that is be opened immediately his ears were opened and the impediment of his tongue was loosened and he spoke plainly what happened here so people they brought this deaf and mute man to jesus they wanted him to touch him and they had heard about his miracles they were expectant jesus took this deaf and mute man aside then jesus he put his finger on the deaf ear of this person the the fear of this person then he spat and touched his tongue then jesus he looked up to the heavens he sighed and said ya fata be opened my dear friend what happened then immediately his ears were opened and he there was the impediment of the tongue that also disappeared it was loosened and he spoke plainly he was able to speak very clearly just like any other normal human being of those times what happened it was jesus the presence of jesus that did the healing the touch of jesus that did the healing yes one word from jesus when he said ya fata be open instantaneously immediately this problem vanished my dear friend 
you might be also in a similar situation maybe you are physically sick maybe you are deaf maybe you can't hear maybe you are struggling with that then jesus has the same words for you your father be opened immediately you will see your miracle the word spoken by jesus it has power the power to create the power to recreate the power to build the power to perform wondrous miracles signs wonders and miracles whatever jesus prayed it happened whatever jesus proclaimed it came to pass my dear friend right now call unto jesus don't look at any man turn to jesus the one true god who can change your situation if you are deaf be healed right now in the name of jesus if you are deaf if you are mute if you are dumb yes speak right now in jesus mighty name be loosened in jesus mighty name just as this person spoke plainly you will speak plainly in jesus mighty name maybe you are saying that you are blocked on all sides you don't have a way your father i declare a new way open in jesus mighty name open in jesus mighty name yes be opened whatever the circumstances that you are going through whatever the obstacles that people or man or any enemy has laid around you i declare that open open a new way let it open come out of the trouble in the name of jesus your father be opened maybe you have a particular need whatever be it your father be opened in jesus mighty name the same god who can heal the deaf and the mute he is still on the throne he is the one true god his name is jesus he is alive and well he is not dead he died for you at the cross of calvary for the redemption of your sins he he was dead he was buried he was kept on the tomb for 3 days on the third day he rose again from the dead yes now he is in heaven yes he ascended into heaven before that he promised that he will come back quickly are you ready to receive him my dear friend whatever be the problem whatever be the circumstances i declare every problem vanish in the name of jesus disappear in jesus mighty name anything that is closed i declare ye fatha be opened in jesus mighty name then what happened this person was healed instantaneously immediately he began to hear and he began to speak he began to speak plainly so plainly just like any other human being that is the one touch yes one word can change your life but that word must be from jesus and the word is be healed right now in jesus mighty name and when this happened what happened then he commanded them that they should tell no one but the more he commanded them the more widely they proclaimed it so jesus he did not seek popularity he did not he just did not want anybody to know about it he just advised them uh, leave it don't uh, proclaim it but the more he commanded them to be to tell no one the more he commanded them the more widely they proclaimed it so this news spread like wildfire people from everywhere they came to know that jesus was was going to, through a particular place and a deaf and a mute person was brought to him and jesus took him aside and jesus he inserted his fingers in the ears of this deaf person then he spat and he touched the tongue of this person then he looked up to heaven he sighed and proclaimed ye fatha be opened and immediately instantaneously this person could hear and he began to speak plainly because his tongue was loosened by one word one word from the creator can change everything one word from the master can change your situation you might say that you are in a situation of impossibility the good news is that our master he is the master of impossibilities right now i declare supernatural acceleration in jesus mighty name every closed doors opened your father in jesus mighty name whatever be the prayer request that you have i declare it 
open let it be granted in the name of jesus i declare good tidings to you good news to you good news good news to you every day every second we you will receive exceedingly abundant joy in jesus mighty name you will win you will run through a troop you will no longer despair yes i declare happiness joy prosperity all good tidings in the name of jesus every sickness disappear in jesus mighty name be healed in jesus mighty name every situation change for the better in jesus mighty name ye father then and they were astonished beyond measure saying he has done all things well he makes both the deaf to hear and the mute to speak this is what jesus does he has done all things well you might say that you are in the gutter most situation in your life i declare let that let the same god let him take you to the uttermost yes you will you will prosper my dear friend because he does everything well whatever be the situation he can change it if you're blind receive sight right now in the name of jesus if you're dumb speak right now in the name of jesus if you're deaf hear right now in the name of jesus if you are paralyzed take up your bed and walk right now in the name of jesus if you came in a wheelchair you will take that wheelchair and you will you you, you will carry that wheelchair and you'll go back i declare and decree in jesus mighty name if you're better and right now rise up in the name of jesus the name which is higher than any disease whatever be the sickness whatever be the problem the name that can solve any problem the name that can destroy any disease the name that can destroy cancer the name that can cure hiv the name that can free you from all bondages break it in this every addiction every drug addiction i break it in the name of jesus anything that comes against you i break it any witchcraft any evil powers anything that is targeted i break it by the authority of the holy ghost i break anything that comes against you in jesus mighty name live long i declare that you will live long and declare the works of the living god jesus loves you